Senator Gerald Boudreau has in Challenger. The two men are vying for votes in parts of Lafayette, St. Landry, and St. Martin parishes. Tonight, Kendria LaFleur introduces us to the candidates. Gerald Boudreau has been the state senator for District 24 for four years and wants to continue to serve his constituents. The experience that I gained the first four years will put me in a position where we can probably uh, have a little more input um, on what comes back home and how we continue to build uh, that model that model that will deliver services to all of our citizens. Boudreau wants to help pass laws that can help veterans with resources. He also wants to focus on the education system. I'm looking forward to, to, to more dialogue, um, a changing of some of the policies that are in place. I think we test way too much in the classroom. We need more instructional time and less testing time. Um, I think that comes from the students, comes from the teachers, it comes from the, all of the educators. So education would be uh, one of the areas that I, I want to continue to work on. Boudreaux's opponent, Corey Levier, is a political newcomer. He's a U.S. Armed Forces veteran who's now a firearm instructor. If I went to war for Americans that I don't know, imagine what I'm going to do for the Americans that I do know. And the time has come simply to, uh, to fight for the health, welfare, fight for the justice, you know, for the people of District 24. Levier says he wants to solve issues in the district without raising taxes. He also wants to focus on legalizing cannabis and mentorship opportunities for children. It's very, very important that we uh, send energy towards early childhood development and the mentoring of young, young people, teenagers, so that, you know, they can have a better understanding of what life is. Um, and it's very important that we uh, legalize and decriminalize cannabis in the state of Louisiana. I think it would be a great step and we can set a great example for the country. In District 24, Kendrill Fleur, KATC TV3. At the Hyman Convention Center, the Acadiana Diversity Job Fair celebrated 50.